Cleek Derrick Keller is an American former competition swimmer who won medals at the 2000, 2004, and 2008 Summer Olympics in the 400m freestyle and the 4x200m freestyle relay. In January 2021, Keller was arrested and charged with three offenses stemming from his presence at the 2021 storming of the United States Capitol. He was indicted on seven charges by a grand jury the following month to which he has since pleaded, not guilty. Keller was born March 21, 1982, in Las Vegas, Nevada, to mother Karen and father Kelly. Both parents were intercollegiate athletes at Arizona State University. His father played basketball and his mother swam. His older sister Kelsey swam for University of Washington and younger sister Carleen swam for University of Southern California and competed at the 2004 summer. Olympics. Keller grew up in Phoenix, Arizona, and graduated from Arcadia High School in 2000. Per the later account of John Urbancheck, who later coached Keller, he had a rough time at home. Others have corroborated that Keller had a dysfunctional home life. At the 1999 U.S. National Swimming Championships, Keller won bronze in the 1,500 meters freestyle, behind Chris Thompson and Eric Wendt. Keller also competed in the 400m freestyle, placing fifth behind Chad Carvin, Eric Wendt, Ujur Taner, and Mark Wauketon. Keller won gold in the 5K open water race at the 1999 Phillips 66 National Championships with a time of 46 is to 51, earning him a spot in the same event the 1999 Pan Pacific Swimming Championships. In the 5K Open Water Race at the 1999 Pan Pacific Swimming Championships, Keller won gold with a time of 55 is to 42. Keller attended the University of Southern California for two years from 2000 to 2001, but left school to focus on swimming. While at USC, Keller won multiple individual and relay Pac-10 and NCAA championships in the 200, 500 and 1650 yard freestyle as well as freestyle relays. He was a four-time NCAA champion. Keller competed in the 2000, 2004, and 2008 Summer Olympics. During the four-times 200-meter freestyle relay in the Athens Summer Olympics in 2004, Keller held off a charging Ian Thorpe in the anchor leg to win the race by 0.13 seconds. This was the first time Australia had been beaten in the event in over seven years. In January 2016, Andy Ross of the magazine Swimming World named it as one of the greatest Olympic relays of all time. The American relay of Michael Phelps, Ryan Lochte, Peter Van de Kuy, and Keller were undefeated in competition from the Athens Games onward. Van de Kuy, Larson Jensen, Eric Wendt, and Keller made up the core of the premier American mid-distance, distance freestyle swimmers. Cleet was one of many 2000 Olympic medalists from the Race Club World Team. A summer swimming camp in Florida. From 2004 to 2007, Keller trained at Club Wolverine, run at the University of Michigan in Ann Arbor under John Urbancheck and later Bob Bowman. Urbancheck would also be the coach of the three Olympic swimming teams which Keller competed on. In 2007, Keller left Ann Arbor and returned to USC to finish school and train under coach Dave Salo. In his 2006 season, at the US Championships he achieved the top time in the world in the 400 freestyle. He also won three medals at the Pan Pacific Swimming Championships that year. Twice during his career, he was the cover athlete of Swimming World. In 2015, the Reno Gazette Journal named Keller as the most decorated Olympian ever born in Nevada. Keller was identified as a participant in the 2021 storming of the United States Capitol, where he was seen inside the Capitol Rotunda in a crowd of people clashing with police officers. Keller's presence was reported to authorities by several people who saw a video posted by conservative outlet Town Hall. Some of the people who recognized Keller in the video said that he had frequently posted pro-Donald Trump content on his social media accounts. His social media accounts have since been deleted. Several former teammates and coaches had been among those who reportedly identified him. He was able to be recognized.
In part, because of his height, the fact that he was wearing a US Olympic team jacket, and that his face was unobstructed in the video. Reports of his involvement in the storming were reported in the media on January 11th. On January 13th, for his involvement in the storming of the Capitol, Keller was charged by the FBI with obstructing law enforcement engaged in official duties, unlawfully entering Capitol grounds, and disorderly conduct on Capitol grounds, depending on the outcome of his case. For these charges alone, Keller could face up to 15.5 years in prison. Keller surrendered himself to federal authorities the following day. It was later revealed in federal court records that, the same day that Keller surrendered himself, federal agents executed a search and seizure warrant on Keller's home. Keller was released from custody the same day on a personal recognizance bond. A federal judge ordered him no.